Police say graffiti and tagging cases are spiking in Tooele as businesses work to combat the problem. Yeah, new special Sandra Adams is live right now on how they're hoping art is the answer to this. Andrew? Well, Mike, those businesses are definitely having to get creative. Given the sheer numbers, we've seen tags like these all over downtown tonight. It's really hard to keep up, and business leaders and police alike are combating the issue on a couple different fronts. It makes our downtown look trashy, and we don't want that. In the heart of this small town, and it's very frustrating. Graffiti in purple, pink, and blue has business owners seen red. People walking in your door, that has to be inviting, and that doesn't help. Tyson Hamilton and others are frustrated over the recent spike in tags across Tooele's downtown. We'll make it look nice again, and the very next day they're out doing it again, tagging it. Right down here, we've got a case that we're working on right now. Police say the graffiti has been nonstop. Almost every night for the past few months, we, we've had at least one or two new tags come up. And as investigators decipher the only clues left behind. All right, are we looking at the same paint colors? It is excruciating work to try and tie different tags together. Businesses are often stuck covering the costs of the damage. And it's just uh, what they feel is like a revolving door of continually getting victimized. And we decided to combat the graffiti. We wanted murals. And this does combat graffiti. Tula's Downtown Alliance recently began the mural program and has plans to expand it. We're looking at doing uh, two more here coming up in the next year and a half or so. People will drive around looking for murals to get pictures in front of them. Business leaders say if taggers don't get the message. You want to do art, that's art. Graffiti's not. The murals will eventually spell it out for them. You want to be appreciated for what you can do? Do one of these. Well, you see that camera up there. Police are encouraging business owners to install cameras and say if they see something, say something. Meanwhile, investigators say they're getting close on another suspect they believe is responsible for about 75% of the graffiti cases around town. Back to you. Yeah, I'll take murals over graffiti any day of the week. Andrew, nice story. Thank you.